Well, let me do a proper introduction. This is our Hellraiser cart. It's our 2022 build. It has two 24 volt, 50 amp hour lithium battery modules out of a Chevy Volt wired in series to give us a 48 volt 50 amp hour battery pack we now have a ME0708 48 volt motor um, the specs are 150 amps continuous 300 amp peak and it's supposed to be roughly 5 horsepower continuous and 15 horsepower peak and weighs about 28 pounds according to the specs this is that little 1000 watt motor we tried previously and 1000 watt 5000 watt alrighty and we have a 48 tooth sprocket and a I'm gonna have to double check on that okay I double checked yeah we have a 16 tooth drive sprocket on the motor and a 48 tooth driven sprocket on the axle that gives us a 3 to 1 gear ratio and when we was running the little motor it has a 10 tooth sprocket on the motor with our 48 tooth drive sprocket gives us a 4.8 to 1 gear ratio so that was a bit much for that little guy but moving on our contactor is a J ZJ 400 amp 48 volt our controller is a Kelly KDZ 48 volt 400 amp and uh, our motor I think I already told you about the motor and the batteries and the circuit breaker is off the complete cart is off When we turn the circuit breaker on all the dash instruments and everything are still off but we have a side meter to let us know that the system is energized now and what the voltage in the battery pack is and the wiring in the whole system now we turn the key switch on the contactor will come on the speed controller will come on our power meter will come on and also our speedometer you heard the contactor there's our power meter showing 48.7 volts in the battery pack and I haven't charged it since our last test with the little motor so we've used 104 watt hours and our green LED is lit on the Kelly controller letting us know we are good to go so this will be our first test run with the bigger motor the ME0708 all right we'll start off from a dead stop first test with the ME0708 motor and the Hellraiser cart
did a quick check around. Everything still seems to be a okie dokie. Oh well, give her another go. in no time flat. That was a nice little run and uneventful. Uh, motor is mildly warm but not too bad. Be controlling not at all. None of the cables feel warm. No. And the brakes is good and hot. I'm almost thinking that's gonna be our first upgrade. Yeah, all in all, it did wonderful. So, more to come.